Hello guys, we're gonna be here back with another video today. We're gonna to be playing some 911 operator. So let's go ahead and get right into this. I'm going to click free game and then we're going to go to Albuquerque, New Mexico on normal difficulty. One eternity later. Alright, so whenever the game loads were prompted with this menu, I'm not gonna change anything since I don't exactly have that much money according to the game so i can't really change anything so i'm just gonna go ahead and start my deployment and then we have this uh game here where we can tell our units where we want to go so i want to get some ems down there uh, some police over here because the police bike isn't exactly the best some ems up there and some fire up there well no that those units could probably actually cover that up there, so I don't want to get that covered as well. Alright. So, I believe we have four police, three EMS, and three firefighters. Uh, and they're kind of distributed across the map, but okay, so let's go ahead and start this. New incident. Police incident. One suspect possibly armed. I'm going to send a police van down there. Check it out. Uh, fire alarm. Need for a technical job. No, I want the firefighter. There we go. your emergency hello i have a problem uh, someone is trying to get into my house through the back door we need to figure out uh where this is you live? i live at so tell me what's happening it's probably that crazy ray my ex-boyfriend i heard knocking at the door he's probably drunk again what should i do uh does he have a weapon let's just hide him yeah That's a your call. I'll tell you what to do and what not to do. You have to decide this yourself. But remember, the law allows you self-defense in your own home. Ray, Ray, I have a gun. Please stop. Ray, I will shoot you. Get away from the door. I think I calmed it down. Come here quickly. Okay, we have a unit in route. We could send all. No, we don't have a reason to send all. Uh, red light fence. That car does not seem to be catching up good to that red light fence. I don't think we're going to be arresting anybody for the red light fence, but that car at least needs to catch up to him. That car is going to drive right by the police station at that rate. New incident. Police incident. And one suspect possibly armed. Stalker. Okay. So this is a little bit more serious. So so, we might eventually need EMS if this call goes south. Uh, we have an EMS right there. Okay, that case is resolved. Surprisingly, we didn't have to arrest anybody for that case, so I could have actually sent the biker. Uh, what's going on? Okay, so this could potentially be domestic abuse, so I'll just say, do they have any weapons? Did you hear something that might indicate that they might be armed in any way? Somebody's shouting threats about pulling out a gun. Okay, I need to figure out where this is. The address you're calling from. I heard the gun is in the first person of one room. I can hear you there. Okay, there we go. Uh, I'll send help. So this is very risky because these people are going to be angry. They obviously have a weapon. So this might eventually turn into a shootout. And we don't exactly have that many units available at the current time. 
This seems to be taking a while. Okay. We can intercept that. Our vehicle theft. What's this? A uh, police and EMS. This is family abuse, so this is a dangerous uh call to be on. So I have because they're angry, they might have weapons. I mean, it doesn't say we have weapons, but the situation could develop. Uh, so yes, we have one suspect. We have one for medical assistance. It's unknown whether they're armed or not. New incident, that's just childbirth, so I'm still getting an EMS down there. This seems to be taken off. We need EMS. Yep, that's what I'm saying. Anything has the ability to turn into a shootout, so we have additional units in route. This is, the spike is two officers. Oh, uh, when... Why would you wait until the next day to report a robbery anyways? Like, my reputation dropped because I ignored it, but I felt like it was the right thing to do to ignore it. There's no reason to send the unit down there. It happened yesterday. The suspect's going to be long gone. So we have two injured... <laughs> They'll take that ambulance temporarily out of service because each ambulance can support two personnel and uh, this is two people. And then we have the caller as well. Okay, red light fence. I'm not exactly trying that hard to get the people with red light fences if there's more serious matters. Like if a red light fence comes in and then like an armed robbery comes in, I will try to deal with the armed robbery and just ignore the red light fence in this game. Because it's a red light fence, it's not as serious as four people storming a bank, uh, w four armed people storming a bank. So I will try to prioritize that over the red light fence. In this game at least. I don't know if that's how it works in real life or not. Okay, so we need... This is home invasion. I'll get two units over there. Uh, so that'd be four officers. And then I'll also get the EMS. Okay. New call. What's your name, sir? Oh, what happened? Now, I'm in a really tricky situation because I'm not sure if the uh, situation's high priority enough to send the firefighters, but I will get negative reputation if I don't, so I'll send them. New incident. Um, really? That? <laughs> Suspicious guy just offered, quote, something nice to buy. No, don't buy the something nice. That's how you end up in the back of a van. A drunk driver, that's really serious. It could potentially turn into a situation that also involves EMS and fire department. So we need to get that dealt with as quickly as we can. Now, calls like the one that just got solved are very tricky calls because they require a lot of units to deal with, and you also have the potential of losing units on those calls. So, I always send more than one police vehicle just in the event I need it. So, we have a broken bone. I'm going to send the EMS. That probably isn't the closest EMS. That's probably the closest EMS. I'd say they're about the same distance. Arrest that guy, I guess. Ready for the next. 
New call. Sir, we got a 911 call from your phone. Do you have an emergency? Uh, what do you mean? It's my phone. It's an accidental call 911. Sir, are you having an emergency? No, I'm not. Please lock your phone and make sure you won't call 911 by accident again, okay? That way you won't take up an emergency line for more important calls. Of course. Uh, I'm calling you for more emergency calls. Okay, so... He obviously stated that it was an accident, so I'm going to go ahead and ignore this call because I don't believe it's high priority enough compared to the more important things like accident by drunk driver. I mean, he did state he accidentally called it. When we first uh, called it in, it sounded like he was walking. I know you couldn't hear that, but on my end, he, it sounded like he was just walking. So I really honestly don't believe it's high priority enough to send a unit down there but we will lose reputation if we ignore calls this broken bones never do get solved because i diverted the ems that was actually on route See, this is what I mean, the accident by drunk driver evolved, or the drunk driver evolved into an accident by drunk driver, and that involved both police and EMS. I mean, we did solve the drunk driver case, it's just that another accident by drunk driver did happen, so it's quickly deal, so it's important to quickly deal with the drunk drivers before they evolve into something more, much worse. So yes, I did time out on the broken bone call, but I had no EMS in the local area. I ignored the robbery, which was the right thing to do. The crime was committed yesterday, sending emergency units wasn't necessary. Then why did I lose reputation for not sending units? And then I ignored the empty call. This call was made by an unlocked phone. Once again, it was the right thing to do. Uh, there wasn't a reason to send a unit. So, I ignored it, and uh, I lost reputation for it still. So, in this game, you really have to balance getting your reputation high while also act while also sending units to the calls that do matter. So, that's to be it for this video. If you like this video, then be sure to leave a like and subscribe. It helps out the channel, helps good content like this work with others. That's all from me for now. Funuber, out.